So this is pseudo intellectualism at its finest. So okay, let's let's critique this a little bit. This part right this here. This thing where he he you know kind of switched a, a focus of reality onto um, meaning rather than than things. Mm -hmm. And this was just such a profound mm -hmm. thing for me to hear because it just seemed like he says it just seemed to line up with something I already knew. Okay, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Like, all right. So, first of all, <laughs> what is, if we've watched now, you know, for four minutes or something, what has she said besides that she used to restore old furniture or something, you know? She said anything else that means anything. <laughs> She's got to talk about something, man. So her point here is that I think Jordan Peterson, right? He said, yeah. uh, he said, let's change our focus right. from the objects to the meaning. This. Ah, <laughs> this. and when you frame it that way, you start to see things differently. You really do. Now, this apparently either blew her mind, blew her vagina, or both. Hmm. You can tell from her response here. She is really engaging intellectually. Yeah. You can see it in her face. See that? <laughs> She's working hard <laughs> to yeah. emote this emanation right. of thought. Right. She is struggling. Mm -hmm. And so then I just um, that particular thing at that time, and it's not long ago that I that I got involved in Robert Pierce. It was about the same time that I read that book, and it was just like, wow, this is it. You know, this is <laughs> this is someone who is trying to. <laughs> <laughs> so you know, I wish I was like that. I didn't know that. Wow, <laughs> this is it. Here's this the, is what I've been looking for. <laughs> Here's the thing, baby. We, you and I, we can know just how important our person is because you could tell her response. She wasn't treated like like you know. It was something familiar, commonplace, or or unspectacular. Yeah. She was like, "Wow, right. like this is some serious shit." I mean, you better pay attention. I Everybody really, better pay attention to this. I see. Look at this. See to identify as as you are, you know, as you are doing um, the patterns of the structure of reality or the structure of reality on a metaphysical level uh, that is that is not materialistic. Mm -hmm. And and so, um, and so I, I I became very drawn to to this, and that's hold on. Just to clarify, Spacey, she is making the the bold bold claim that there are things that are not physical, not objects, not stuff. <laughs> is that the outrageous nonsense she's trying to make <laughs> claim here? Well, no, it's just that we've shifted the focus. Oh, right. And everything changed. Right. Exactly. And from that's that the important moment thing right there. We knew that. Right before Jordan Peterson, the when focus hadn't shifted yet. No, it had. It's, it's that what I called, what I referred to before as a crisis of meaning. Meaning crisis. You know, you had done the, the metaphysics of Pepe, but the, but the but the video that I really loved that you did was uh, symbolic versus literal meaning in the Bible, and that really kind of made me addicted to your channel. And and so I noticed, you know, with you and with you know, under the umbrella, I guess, of Robert Pierce, it was I, I was very interested in Jordan at that time, so I was really focused on his work. But I kind of sort of segued into piercing which is where i am now but but i noticed that with you you have the symbolic um oh my god okay so first of all who which is jordan she referring to jordan peterson yeah yeah 
Why is he calling Jordan? She must know him personally. She calls Persig, Persig. Persig's right. last name is Persig. All right. I think that's what she's trying to intimate here is that I think I don't think she knows him. I think I bet you it's this. She's trying to contrast between She's she's doing that collegial thing. Like we're colleagues. Right. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's right. what I'm saying. It's like first name basis, but like not because they're good friends. Does this bother you? <laughs> this bothered me a lot. Does this does this exist? Well, this is like so this common. Is like, this, no, this is like cringe for NTPs. It's perfect. Like, it's horrible. Like she so hasn't said a goddamn thing yet. She had me almost in tears. She has not said a goddamn thing. Meaning structure, and your brother with his with his book, and I know you and him. It's very related. Um, Jordan Peterson has his maps. Um, Rebel Will Wisdom is reintroducing Ken Wilbur, who has his quadrants. Um, um, you know, Verveke has his has the anagoge and the connection to the real world. So it's so related, and it just seems like everyone is trying to discover this meaning on this new plane, on this non-material. Oh, oh, so painful. <laughs> Oh, oh my man. god. <laughs> I will do what she just did with philosophy, okay? I'm gonna demonstrate what she just did. You know, it was Jordan Peterson. I saw one of his videos and he pointed out that people had been thinking about ideas forever <laughs> and I was just like wow <laughs> no. well, let me tell you something though I've been looking into it and it's all related it's like you interviewing it's your book <laughs> it's like it's like Jordan Peterson's book it's like some of the great philosophers like Aristotle it's all related I was there I was I, I've been reading it it's like Socrates you see, I'm an expert too. You get it. It's all it's all connected. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that reminds me of college professor that had UC Santa Cruz. <clears throat> this is like one of they just were saying like the, notice how she keeps referring back to her feelings about things like And so then I encountered Kant and I was just like, Oh, mm. oh. This, this is it. <laughs> this is what it means to be W O K E woke. A woke philosopher. Is this philosophy one on one? I don't really feel like I'm learning anything. <laughs> you are aware, aren't you? <laughs> you aren't saying anything. <laughs> that was like. Wow. Oh, Jesus Christ. Wow. Yeah. This, this, we'll react to her thing like she reacts to stuff. I mean, when I heard her say that, that nonsense, hilarious. that was just like... <laughs> <laughs> okay, she is. We've been up for a bit. Oh my goodness.